Alexa, Batcave on. Today is March 27th, 2020. And what a wild time to be alive right now. We will get through this. This is a, uh, a very unknown time still. For us, we have been quarantined for 11, 12 days now with minimal access to really anything. I mean, everything is shut down, bars, restaurants. You know, it's one of those things that you just, you follow the rules and you're staying home to protect the general public. You're staying home to really try and avoid what's going on with all this. I wanted to just kind of give an update before we jump into the really meat of this video, the YouTube studio, the renovation, just trying to take the necessary precautions. I don't know, we're just hanging out inside and we haven't really, other than getting some groceries once, I just encourage each and every one of you to stay home until we get this all figured out, until our nation world figures this all out. I think they're learning more each and every day. Thank you to the first responders, everyone who is working tirelessly to counter this pandemic, this craziness. I hope you're not all going too insane. Enjoy this little video and I hope it provides some entertainment. Part two of the renovation, quarantine stops. Jason and I are gonna go hit a quick bike ride. It's nice just being able to get outside, get some fresh air. We're walking the rest of the way. This hill is way too big. Jace took us on a gnarly route. Jace, you dying yet? But it's nice out. All right, I'm excited to be in the space. Finally, it's been a long time coming. Not that long, but I've wanted to do this for a while. Yeah. I'm super excited about it. I think it's turned out awesome. My goal with this little space, so it's a smaller space than the previous space. The previous space was in a front room. Apologies for that previous video, part one. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Link it right up here. It was an absolute mess, disaster, like a tornado came through. But you know, it's like moving a house, right? When you got, you're just trying to move stuff and you got stuff and I didn't really care, film. Whatever, my wife was a little embarrassed. I don't, shh, whatever. My goal with this room was really to make it as multi-function as I could. So I wanted to try and create multiple different backgrounds, multiple different stations to really create more videos, to really do some more product shoots, some more just create, just a, a space where I could create more. It's coming together. There's still a few things I wanna do. I still, I still gotta work, gotta work on, on, this on this reverb, reverb echo, 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 echo. I'm gonna get some soundproofing. Ultimately with a studio, a home studio for YouTube specifically, that's really what you're trying to accomplish and you're really trying to set what your mood is for your channels. I got a window right here that can provide some natural light. I have my light right here just beaming on me. I added these cool little, these cool little guys. I don't know, I might move them, might not. My wife thinks I'm an absolute nerd for the Alexa response. A lot more outlets in this room, so that gives me a little bit more flexibility with plugging in cords in different areas. I got multiple outlets on this side, multiple outlets on that side. My desk space, computer space, right over there. It is nice having that closet right back there. I can store all the gear in there. It's not exposed to the front of the house. Right when you walked in our door, it was like, Gear, clutter, eyesore. Welcome to our house. This is much better, it's secluded. I'm in the back cave, underground, secret bookshelf you pull down and then under a tunnel and then the elevator goes down and then you go across and under and 
Alexa, Batcave off. Okay. Super cool. Yeah. Multiple options. Lighting behind my screens to give a little bit more of an effect. Still gonna do a couple more things to this room. Gonna add some shelves behind you guys. If you would just turn, do a 180 on that wall. Let me just show you. Do a little tour real quick. Show you. Desk space right here. Calendar, gotta have a calendar. If you can get a mirror, a full size mirror inside your, your office space, really helps open up the room. So I've heard I'm not an interior designer at all. It's actually my wife's probably gonna move because she's gonna take it back. Dang it. All the stands, you can see it's kind of set up like this. So we have black wall, door to the main area of the house. And then we have this wall. We're gonna do some additional shelves so I can just flip on the other side of this desk. The gear closet, a little taller, customized shelves. So there you have it. I mean, just still a work in progress, still some things to add. Um, but that's kind of the fun of this whole thing is just creating a new space, creating, and I think when you create a new space that you really enjoy being in, it, it brings more creativity. Back cave on. Okay. Oof. Nerd out, nerd status. So I hope you enjoyed this two part series, YouTube behind the scenes, studio, renovation, home, room, interior decorating. I'm not an interior decorator at all. Alexa, back cave off. All right guys, I appreciate you guys stopping by. If you like this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more videos like this. I'll see you again real, real soon. Stay safe out there, stay strong, be kind. Let's get through this.